The Independent Review Panel, which has been looking at the Police Federation, has now completed its work and we're publishing our report. We're proposing a very significant programme of reform, but we have a simple aim, which is to ensure that the Federation is a trusted voice for frontline police officers. That's our core proposition. Over the last nine months, We've listened to a lot of people's views about the Federation. We've been to every part of the country. We've talked to representatives and officers at branch and national level. We've talked to external stakeholders. And above all, we've listened to the views of members. We carried out one of the biggest surveys ever done of uh, the views of Federation members. And a striking outcome of that was that 91% of Federation members think there needs to be change. So our report is derived from a lot of evidence. We're proposing that the Federation needs to rebuild trust. Trust from the public and trust from its members. We want it to be more professional in the way it operates in its standards of behaviour and conduct. And we want it to speak with a single voice, which it often doesn't do now, and we're proposing a structure of representation and governance which will encourage that. And underlying that, we think the Federation needs to show that it's offering value for money. Value for money for its members' subscriptions and for the investment from the public, which the public makes in the Federation. Change is always difficult. There'll be lots of people with different views about how quickly it should go and what should be done. But we really think there's an opportunity here. And most of all, it's an opportunity for the members to have an effective staff association representing it and being a trusted and significant and influential voice in policy making at local and national level. We'd like everybody to get behind this report, to discuss it, to debate it, and then to build up the momentum to get the change going. As I say, there's a great prize here, a great opportunity to make this Federation once again a trusted voice for frontline police officers.